Uh, my name is Manuel Guerra Casas. I live in Port St. Lucie, Florida. I am an undocumented immigrant. I, uh, I want to share my story with you because uh, many undocumented immigrants are afraid sometimes to share their story. And I wanted to tell you that I came to America in a search of a better life for myself and my family. I came to reunite with my other, older sisters um, I wasn't able to come here legally because of the immigration laws. It was, it was very difficult for me to get a visa back then and everybody was coming illegally. Uh, so I decided to come illegally because uh, there was no way for me to apply for a visa or I didn't have the money or maybe my visa would never be approved because the conditions where I live or, or no education. So I decided to come with my one of my older sisters um, in December of 1999, and we crossed the river. We swim across the river. Um, we walked through the mountains for f five days, and I finally made it to uh, Texas, to Dripping Springs, Texas. There, I washed dishes for seven months. Um, I didn't speak a word of English. Uh, then after a few, after seven months, I moved to Florida where I met with my older older sister. Um, I started working in landscaping for about two years. Um, I started attending church. I got involved in the youth group in church. And then I wanted to um, to do more. I wanted to, I discovered that I, my, my passion to help people and I wanted to be a priest. So I met this priest and, and and my city in Indian Town, where he encouraged me to go to school, and he helped me to go to school for two years. In two years, I graduate. Um, I, I was about to go to the seminary to become a priest, and then eventually a chaplain. But um, I realized that I was undocumented. I wasn't able to fix my undoc my illegal status, so I was put into uh, deportation, and then. Um, uh, I was about to be deported, and that's and then I started fighting uh, against uh, anti-immigrant laws uh, here in Florida and Arizona. And uh, but I want to be able to contribute. I still want to. I'm still illegally. I didn't uh, apply for the fair action, so I still want to be able to contribute to this country. I want to have the opportunity to serve uh, in many ways and to give back. With this country has. So, um, yeah, that's me. <laughs>